The number of people killed in traffic accidents in Michigan is up for the second straight year, and one of the main reasons why may surprise you. It starts with the economy. The better the economy, the more money people have in their pockets, and that means they'll be willing to drive more often and further distances. And as Fox 47's Christopher Lane explains, more drivers means more crashes. Half the accidents that I've come close to getting in is because of other people and myself. Drivers may not agree on why, but everyone that I talk to says they feel it's gotten more dangerous on the roads in the last few years. To some extent, it's a, it's a process of just uh, more exposure to people being on the road. As, um, Michigan Office of Highway Safety Planning says the economy and number of drivers on the road have been linked for a century. And if you really go back and you look at the, the depression and everything and it, it you know, mm -hmm. fatalities in the economy just, but you see they, they indeed are linked. Many of those deaths come because of people not using safety features in their cars or driving impaired. We still see a significant number of people who are unbelted in crashes and still about a third of our fatalities involve alcohol and or drugs. Traffic deaths also go up when gas prices go down. That's because more people are on the roads. So that um, just makes it you know, easier for people to drive more miles. The good news is that even with the increases over the last two years, the number of traffic deaths is way down in the last Last 40, thanks to things like airbags and seatbelt laws. The number of traffic deaths continues to de to overall decline on the long term, um, even though we do see increases as the economy improves. In Lansing Township, Christopher Lane, Fox 47 News. Police say cracking down on impaired and distracted driving should reduce the number of crashes and deaths, which is why they're running more enforcement operations.